Hey guys, it's me and <laughs> Zell. Sorry, my intro sounded like it's a me, Mario. Anyways, uh, welcome to the channel, Zell, where I do reaction content. And today we're continuing with Ahsoka, episode six, part six, that is all. We left off with Ahsoka getting rescued from the world between the worlds or the ocean or whatever. And we still, we didn't really touch base with Sabine and friends. They're still traveling to <gasps> potentially to see Thrawn and Ezra, potentially what we could see today. Exciting. And we left off with Ahsoka and Hu Yang in, in, not ghost, in her ship. Go inside in Pergil in speed away in hyperspace inside of Pergil. So really exciting things. And Hera has, is trying to recover from uh, being in trouble. So we'll see how that goes. But yeah, that's all. I'm ready for it. Hope you are too. So let's get to it. Something I didn't tell her about Sabine. Which is? She went with the enemy willingly. Impossible. I saw it through the force when I held the map. Well, that is troubling. She could have ended this. No throne. No war. And no Ezra. Sabine, it was the only choice. Hmm. A choice she made for herself. That is your fear. On second thought, tell me one of those stories. <laughs> is that your to keep choice. him quiet? Very well. A long time ago, in a galaxy far, far away. Aww. Cute. What a fun intro. There we have it. Girl, you went willingly because you want to see Ezra so bad. Still got her little knee guards on, knee shields. You find your situation confining. A bit. I would think this would be an opportunity for reflection. I try to avoid that. I can understand why. We had a deal. You promised me I would see Ezra again. Hey! Do you hey! trust a Sith? We had a deal! No. No, no, no. Have they ever made good on their promise? Preparing to exit hyperspace. <gasps> Sorry, I'm okay, Cal. My dog freaked out when I did the hyperventilating sound. Oh, my stomach. I feel dizzy. Ooh. It's like a Saturn Earth planet. That is Peridia. Peridia. The ancient homeworld of my ancestors, <gasps> the Dathomiri. The Jedi Archive spoke of this place. The end of the migration route used by the star whales as they traverse the void from one galaxy to the other. What? My people were among the first to harness and ride the creatures in the days before time was counted. Did I know that? The whales came here to die. Heridia was a graveyard. A whale graveyard, just like the elephant graveyard in Lion King. Whoa, aw, aw. All the floaty bits are bones. Is this all new? Dathomirians riding Pergil? And are we gonna see any Dathomir people? 
Ooh, that's cool. I feel like Shin is going to do something to make her change her mind. Did he just freaking pee behind me? Bro, please let there be some alive. That ship seems a lot smaller than they're making it seem. It's really cool looking though. <gasps> there is more. My sisters. Bro. So this is like the first time she's seen her sisters in ages? Ugh. Are they like... Are they like those future seeing witches from Hercules? Welcome, child of Dathomir. You do our ancestors credit. Thank you, great mother. You heard our call to you in the dream. Your visions guided me across the stars. More witches. Long have we waited for you. And you came as Thrawn promised. Where is Thrawn? You shall wait. He is coming. It reeks of Jedi. It is dangerous. gonna let those balls do what they want and chop. oh oh my gosh it will wait in solitude oh my gosh oh my gosh oh my gosh oh my gosh How does Shin feel about the witches? What is it, Master? This is a land of dreams and madness. Children's stories come to life. More like nightmares. I know no such stories. You weren't raised at the temple. Stories of this galaxy are temple? considered folk tales. Some ancient past, long forgotten. And I was a bit older than you are now. I watched everything I knew burn. The Jedi Temple? I couldn't make sense of it at the time. As you get older, look at history. You realize it's all inevitable. Rise of the Empire. It repeats again and again and again. Won't our alliance with Thrawn finally bring us into power? That sort of power is fleeting. Hmm. What are you up to, sir? What I seek is the beginning. So I may finally bring this cycle to an end. So his goal was to get to this location, which has something he wants. Hmm. Just curious. Watch that be just an earthquake. He 
Enoch. Are they- are these all dead troopers? Oh my gosh, there he is. What was first just a dream has become a frightening reality for those who may oppose us. Great mothers, I salute you. Oh my gosh. Soon we shall all escape this exile thanks to the efforts of Morgan Elspeth. I am ever your servant, Grand Admiral. This is Enoch, captain of my guard. He shall begin the cargo transfer as per my agreement with the Great Mother. What is he? They have brought a prisoner. You never spoke of this. We did not see it. It is a loose threat. Well, speak to me of this loose threat. This is the guy who the actually prisoner. voices Thrawn, right? She could be of some use to us. And you are? Mercenaries. Mercenaries. And as apprentice, Shinhati. Then you must be General Balan Skull. Of the Jedi Order. I parted ways with the Jedi long ago. You would not be the first. The prisoner is Sabine Wren. Mm. Now there's a familiar name. Mm. She'd be of great use to us. It's always shocking at first getting used to the visuals of it. It's really good makeup. The hair throws me off a little bit, but the voice is wonderful. Sabine Wren. Thrawn. <laughs> what a delight it is after so long to see a familiar face. Where is Ezra? Ah, yes. The desire to be reunited with your long lost friend. How that singular focus will reshape our galaxy. Just answer the question. No need for hostility. I'm aware of your agreement with Balan Skull, and I intend to honor it. Uh. You shall have provisions, amount, and our latest intel on Bridges' whereabouts. Oh, so he's just roaming? So that's it? You're just gonna let me walk out of here? You helped my cause. Now I shall help yours. You I should mean, know I that, don't not that trust once him, my starship departs, you've gambled the fate of your galaxy. On that belief. You wouldn't understand. Ooh, a rat boy. A rat dog. Die well. <laughs> okay. Cool, go talk. Now I was trying to see Ezra. Come on. I guess she maybe. I can't remember if she's ridden a wolf. Loth wolf or not. So maybe she's just familiar. Or she's trusting in the force, doing what Ezra helped teach her. Oh my gosh. I thought you were to honor your agreement. But he shall. Sabine Wren will have the opportunity of finding Ezra Bridger. Just as promised. And if she does, you and your master will destroy them both. Ah. So he's been hunting Ezra or not caring? I don't know how he would not care. Bro. Are they all like robots? They all sound so mechanical. Good too, girl. Okay. What? I guess if you're going against non saber wielders. Grand Admiral, 
The mercenaries have departed. Good. Prepare to attack squads. Wait for Lord Balin's signal. Oh, now they're... Oh. Should we not send more troops to support them? During this exile, our numbers have dwindled. So, no. Two squads will suffice. You! You abandoned me! Don't no, be mean. Should have known you were a coward. He has no... He doesn't have any dedication to you. Oh, I want it. He wants friends. Okay. Fine. Oh. I'll give you another chance, but you better not bail on me this time. Got it? Now we have to take him with us back home with babies to make more. You got something? <laughs> <laughs> I love it. Come on. You were thirsty. Is that it? Now what? Hungry? It's a rock. Uh, uh. You're embarrassing yourself. Okay, yeah, that trick's over. Get up, come on, I can see you there. You're in a completely different galaxy. No speak, basic. Oh, his baby. Uh, uh, uh. It's okay, it's okay. I got this. Tota. Tota! <laughs> That's snarl. No, no, it won't hurt you. <laughs> Just relax over there. He hungry. What's... This? You like this? How is that possible? Ezra, do, do you do you know Ezra? Uh oh. Careful, guys. They're cute. I don't believe it. You. you... You, you you must know Ezra Bridger. Ezra Bridger. Yes. Uh oh, where's Howler? You know him. You've seen him. Bridger? No. He's too young. Comes from a breed of Bokin Jedi trained in the wild after the temple fell. Bokin? Like me? No. He was trained as a Jedi. You. I trained to be something more. Oh. Do you miss it? The Order. I miss... the idea of it. But not the truth. The weakness. There was no future there. I understand that, Balin. I see what once was the great witch kingdom of the Dathmiri. The existence of the Great Mothers confirms this. Hmm. Something calls to me. She's looking out for Got her own here. survival. Something stirs She here. doesn't trust him as much anymore. Can't you see it? I see bandits. They live in like giant shells. Cute. Oh, baby. Their TV antenna. 
They all love this like mobile homes. I knew oh I my could gosh. Count on you. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Though sure took you long enough. Well, you didn't exactly tell any of us where you were going. That's because I didn't know where I was going. Typical. Always a plan. Never a good one. Hey, it worked, didn't it? Didn't it? Uh-oh. It worked. <laughs> <laughs> How'd that happen? In fact, how did you find me? How did you get here? Let's not talk about that. Not right now. Sabine? Hey. Hmm? I just want to be happy that I found you. Thanks for coming. Aww. Can't wait to go home. She's like, yeah. Now how are we going to make that work? Bro, it's finally freaking happened. Another comes. A Jedi. Oh, duh. They How did I forget travelers. that? Well, that is unwelcome news. Could it be the recently deceased Sokatana? Recently deceased? I thought it was beyond you to underestimate a Jedi. After all, death and resurrection are common deceptions played out by both Night Sister and Jedi. We shall consider Sokotano alive until we know otherwise. And we shall prepare accordingly. I want to know her background, history, home world, her master, everything. Yes, Grand Admiral. If a star whale approaches Peridia. No. Destroyed with prejudice. No. I shall once again require the aid of your dark magic. The thread of destiny demands it, Grand Admiral. No, don't hurt the baby Virgo. Bro. That episode. They're getting so good. I mean, they've been so good. Wow. I mean, we finally, finally have it. We're seeing Thrawn. Voice is so beautiful. Saw Ezra. He did well. He did well. He looks the part. He sounds Ezra. Contacts are a little off-putting, but it's a little shocking. You don't see very many people with dark hair, blue eyes. It's blue color, too. It's just, it's almost like Thrawn skin. Sir? Anyways, I'm just nitpicking. It's so good though. And seeing more Night Sisters, which I did not expect that, an ancient Dathomir kingdom, freaking Pergel whale graveyard. We're seeing these cute little turtles, naughty, I guess I call them, naughty, 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 naughty. And then, duh, Ahsoka's coming to town. Ahsoka Tano's coming to town. She's riding on a Pergel. She's coming for revenge. Just kidding. Anyways, I'm so excited. We're gonna see, what, is there two more episodes left? Some sort of battle. I don't know what they're gonna do in the next two episodes. Uh, and the sad thing is, is they're gonna try to kill the Pergil if they get close. And supposedly the Pergil die after this tra after this travel. So there's no way to ride Pergil out of there. So the only way out is the ship. So many questions. And I'm guessing his sh that circle which is why that shape's there, is gonna cling to the side of a ship and go pring and take it. Like a giant one of those ones to make the little ships. Duh, I just put that together. I mean, I said it looks familiar, but it's like the big version of those rings for the big ship. It's finally here. I'm just in disbelief and things look so good. The visuals, it's very like, I love the production quality. 
Um, I feel like something's gonna go down with Shin and Balin. You know, obviously there's nobody dedicated to any one person. I feel like Balin has this, oh yeah, and there's this whole plan of Balin's that we don't know what he's speaking about. I don't, maybe one of you all do, but. So we got lots of things to look forward to. Will Shin go along with his plans? Will they, she think she's, he's cuckoo. And she's like, I, I just wanna get back home, thanks. Lots of questions. But she does seem interested in power. She did say, it's our time. You know, like that innocent, excited face. There you have it. I'm so excited. So guys, thanks so much for being here and watching. If you want to show support for the channel, don't forget to give a thumbs up and like it. Also, don't forget to subscribe the YouTube way. Subscribe so you can be alerted when videos go live on the channel for the next two episodes of Soka and of course more to come in the future of other Star Wars content. But either way, thanks for being here. Thanks for watching and I'll see you on the next one.